Hail deputies. I thought I'd do another update video. So I have my new bed set up. It's nice and comfy. And the sheets on it are nice and soft. I have a new blanket on it as well that's nice and soft. So I'm sleeping much better. No lumps and crinkles and feeling like I'm laying on um, uh, rocks and no slashes to scrape my skin and so thank you very very much mr wonderful benefactor that bought me that bed you are fantastic okay so i went and saw my oncologist today actually i have two oncologists now one that does radiation and one that does chemo so I saw the radiation doctor today. I liked her. She had a good bedside manner. Um, and she gave me a prescription for some oxycodone uh, to fill in the, the, the gap. So it's like I have morphine and then if you know that's not doing the job if I'm having some you know an extra nasty bout of pain or whatever I can take the oxy <clears throat> uh, to fill in the gaps or whatever and uh, so that helps with the pain and I have some anti-nausea medicine. So, so I'm gonna have 10 radiation treatments uh, starting Monday. Uh, so it's gonna be Monday through Friday. Then I'm off for Saturday and Sunday and then I'll be Monday through Friday again. I also have some various tests and they're going to put a port in me because I have my veins collapse and stuff and are hard to find so it's hard to get an IV in me. So that's why the port uh, and um, Let's see. Um, so they did a trial run of uh, radiation treatment. So they didn't actually do radiation on me, but they did. They kind of like got me set up. They put like a big red X on me where they're going to treat, where they're going to target the radiation. Um, they told me not to scrub it off. <laughs> so I'll have that for the duration. And, um, uh, you know, it, it, you know, it takes about, uh, I was told 15 minutes for, for each treatment. And I have to get up like really early in the morning, um, uh, for each day of this. So that's would be Monday. To go and do that bright and early uh, and uh, so I might to go full screen with this but failed to do so but there we go oh those flowers are so pretty I just love that I love that purple and green um So after that, at some point, I'm going to be having chemotherapy, but I don't really know much about that yet. I'm taking it one day at a time, one step at a time. 
and um, so I am dehydrated I'm trying to drink more but it's hard you know I get get nauseous and you know most days I'll have a bout of dry heaves or sometimes if there's water in my stomach I will just throw up the water um, I had a craving for pizza today so I got a I ordered a small pizza from Papa John's my brother picked it up and I actually managed to eat one slice of the pizza and then he got the rest I couldn't eat more than the slice so but I, I've managed to keep it down so that's the good thing so I've actually had some food because before I ate that pizza the last time I ate was Saturday and today is Thursday so you can count the days that I did it did not eat anything at all except water um but you know fasting is actually good for cancer because it starves the cancer the cancer feeds on sugar and carbohydrates so but every now and then I do need to eat something uh, so let's see what what else do I have to say I also had to get some x-rays today and uh, I'm feeling nauseous right now but not to the point of throwing up so I'm trying not to throw up um, so because um, I don't want to throw up my medicine right um, so and by medicine, I mean my painkillers. Because I'm on morphine and, and oxycodone. Uh, although the oxycodone is just take as needed. Morphine is take twice a day. It's, it's a time release tablet. Capsule or whatever. Um... All right, um, that's pretty much it. I, um, you know, I'm feeling better knowing that I want to get start getting my treatment because the sooner I get my treatment, the sooner I can get better, and the sooner I'm better, the, the less pain I should have, and so forth. So. Thanks for being there for me, guys. Thanks for the gifts, the money, the presents, the uh, kind words, and uh, everything. Thank you, especially to my patrons. Uh, hope you guys are doing well, and we'll talk to you later. Bye.